out there in uh, the northern part of the state. Gilmore. Gilmore, yes. Mm -hmm. Gilroy. No, Gilroy. Gilroy. Gilroy, Gilroy California. The, uh, the, the garlic capital of... Uh, Privilege to be with all of you here in Los Angeles. And boy, they are loading big shots between the two. Oh, my. Armando Sandys, second most win against an opponent, 36 and 13. That was against Michael. Something special to be fighting under the lights on national television here in the United States. But Sandys so far is bringing one tough customer, but it would appear as the mm. Sandys, he just unloaded a big right. to be the theme for the sport the past week. That was a nice double hook by Resendis. Is there? Stop, 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 but you, you see how rough Madeira is. Madeira. Even though he's missing, there's a right hand that buckled Madeira. And now, come down with a little bit more body shots because he's head hunting a little too much. That sound wisdom from a boxing coach because he's doing everything well. He's keep using that jab. It was a quick left hook and it landed and just like that short right hand off of Madeira. Madeira came back countering like that right there. See, he's rough. He put that full. But you know what, Joe, if I'm looking at, there's a nice left hook there by my dead lightweight division. But right now, oh, big right hand connecting for Descendis, fighting off the ropes, though. Right, right, right side center. That's why he's getting hit by that right hand. He should be slipping both sides, I looking at that liver no shot. No uh, guys that go under the light sometimes shine more than they do in sparring. There are guys that are great in the... Armando El Toro Descendis. So Armando Resendiz remains undefeated and makes his U.S. debut a successful one.